Tonight we're hearing from the Waverly teenager who was stabbed in the heart. Good evening, I'm Julie Cornell. I'm Rob McCartney. The teenage suspect faces adult charges, including attempted murder. He's in the Lancaster County Jail on a million dollar bond. Tonight, KETV Newswatch 7 Sarah Feely talks with the victim and his mother. She joins us live. The fall break for Waverly schools almost two weeks ago and 15 year old Kyle Punko was out for a walk. He saw somebody out of the corner of his eye and his gut told him something was wrong right away. I literally said to my coworker, I said, Thank God that's not my kids. But the ambulance Ann Punko heard from her desk at work was for her son. He would just called 911 to tell police he'd been stabbed. He got up and the first thing he asked me was, did I get you? 15 year old Kyle Punko says he went for a walk and noticed someone following him. When he asked the 14 year old boy what he wanted, Punko says he told him to make friends. Punko says he told the boy he was done with friends. And I started walking away. That's when I felt the first two stabs. Punko says the two struggled over the knife before the boy ran off. Punko fell headfirst into a water viaduct at Wayne Park in Waverly. Apparently, while I was passed out, he came back and stabbed the four other ones. Prosecutors say the 14-year-old also called 911 to report a murder. Doctors later learned Punko had been stabbed in the heart. The surgeon made the comment, had it been a millimeter to the left, like he probably wouldn't have made it. Punko says he'd never met the boy. I saw him twice in the hallways at school and once in the bathroom, but I haven't even said a word to him at that point. The only time I talked to him was when he was at the crib with me. It was just wrong place, wrong time. Prosecutors allege the teen had been waiting in the park for a target. They think he was looking for fame. Our brains want to have a reason that something happened. And, you know, from what we can tell and the things that we were sent, it's he just, he wanted fame. The Punkos are coming to terms with the random attack. They say their version of justice changes by the day. I'd like to see him get some help for that. Um, but I also don't want him on the street where he could possibly hurt somebody else's child. The suspect has since turned 15. He's charged as an adult. He's charged with attempted murder. Punko says he's also recovering from a concussion as well as those stab wounds. Now, there is a GoFundMe to help with bills. We'll include a link online. Back to you. We wish him well. Thanks, Sarah.